Yeah, according to the patch note, I looked all the 3.23 patch notes, right? Are you talking to me? Yeah, yeah, I'm talking to you. Oh, I thought you were talking for the video. Because okay. this, this, this is this how, something we're going to be looking at. Oh, uh, how may I help you? <laughs> you see all these patch notes says um, about water polish. This one, the first one, says further ship thruster water impact polish. What is that? Means what? when you fly the ship passing through water in a low altitude, you see the wake of the water, you know. Oh, the separation? Yeah, the the water interaction with the with the... the wind or uh, the, uh, okay, okay. right. So water performance pass and another patch note says water VFX wake improvements, and then here is water interaction polish pass. So all these for the water effect. So this is what we're gonna be looking at today. Well, in order to make this video, we need to get out of the station first. Oh, you wanna close the door for the washing machine? It's a drying machine. Oh. If you did the laundry, you would know. Stop laughing. We're not getting out of the station. We're not getting out of the... Well, There's it's no... not my fault. Where's, where's Robert? Who's Robert? It's Robert's space station. Where's Robert? You need to point to Robert. <laughs> Mr. Robert, where is your train? What kind of game are you giving us? Oh, oh, oh tr train's here. Whoa! It just opened the door and closes. Yeah, I told you last time we were too slow. We have a <laughs> micro nanosecond to get on and we were just too slow. Wow. I'm glad that we got on the train. This is nice. It's very smooth. It's like very... a bullet train or something. Yes, this is a bullet train. Oh. <laughs> it's... Wow, very smooth. That was very fast. It's a bullet train, that's why. I know. I said that. I said it's a bullet train. And now it's slow. Because it's arriving in the station. That's why, of course, you need to slow down the train. Otherwise, you can't get out. There we go. What? Whoa. What is that? Is that space? I don't know. It's blackness. Should I step into it? Step into the void. Oh! What the? You're in the ocean, in space. You found a glitch in the in the matrix. It's not the first time. Whoa. I don't know if it's good that I'm like right here when you record, because I feel like I just make things more hectic for you. No, it it actually helps me a little, because uh, I would have given up, given mul up multiple times. On what? On recording Star Citizen. That's because you have hopes. <laughs> <laughs> Oh boy. At this point, you shouldn't have hope. And then <laughs> you won't be. <laughs> I won't be disappointed. I have no yeah. drive then. Okay. <laughs> well, let's. We, we need to take a ship out to investigate the water. So, what ship should we take? I don't know. What do you think has the most powerful wake effect? Well, they were using the Gladius. Okay, let's try that. Okay, we'll take the Gladius out. Uh. Where? It's a new feature, it's invisible. Yeah, this has happened before. Or oh, just wait here, the ship is getting delivered right now. Why is it so hard to do, to do something in Star Citizen? Yeah, first of all, this is PTU, so you have to expect Okay, problem. then where's the U? The what, the U, what U? Well, I'm, I don't know, what is PTU? Practice, terminal, universe? <laughs> okay, where is the non-practice one? The PU. The PU. Yeah, the persistent universe. Per PTU is persistent, persistently testing your patience. That does. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> See, told you. You need patience in the persistently testing your patience universe. Yeah, they changed the whole flight mode to a master mode, master operator mode. So it took me a while to get used to this mode without crashing. Let's go. Whoa! Oh! Did you hear the engine sound? Yeah. I think I like the engine sound much better. The boosting. 
But you know what? I feel like they should make it sound even more crazy. Like, when you rev a Porsche. Do you want to fly? No. I kind of like this, uh, you know, the the physics is a little, little, it's a, the ship is still feel like very light, has no weight, but I like the little bit of shaking, it's more realistic, and the engine sound is, uh, much better, like it, it's definitely better, I think. Okay, let's uh, fly out of orbit. They also increased the ballistic ammo count. My Mantis has uh, 2,133 rounds. You probably don't know what it means. No. But I'm gonna do another video for that myself. Okay. What was it before? Before, I think it's a 200 something for different... Uh, oh, it's like multiplied by 10? Yeah, I have to check every single ballistic weapon, see what the ammo count oh, cool. is now. It's one of the thing I love about Star Citizen is the cinematics, you know, the, the beauty of the universe, the details, and the water effect is going to add to it. Are you sure there's water here? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Oh, there. Yeah, right here. All right, let's check it out. Oh, I don't want to get inside the ocean and die. Oh, you oh. can see. Oh. oh, okay, okay. Right? It's nicer, but you have to get quite low. On the... Very close to the water. Yeah. Oh, I'm... I'm still getting used to the new fly system, so... Uh. Right? Ah, the water bought a little bit of weird... Oh. What? What happened? I died. You died? Yeah. How? I don't know. I'm not even inside the water. There's no one to crash into. Nothing. Well, you, we crashed into Star Citizen, so... Oh, we choose the 600i. It's a good explorer. Beautiful. Isn't that the one that I liked? Yes, that's the one you, you like. It looks super fancy. Yeah. I might have to cut a lot of this off, honey. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> <laughs> Just to do one little thing, we actually did for like a few minutes, right? For the for the first. I mean, I didn't expect so much problems for the basics, like the train arriving. The ship not the showing ship up. Not showing up. Yeah, this is what player going through. Sometimes even in the PU. <laughs> <laughs> we wait. There we go. Oh, wow, so fancy with the gold accents. Yeah. Wow. This is what I imagine like Jeff Bezos. Having. I don't like that guy. A lot of people don't. <laughs> but <laughs> okay. that's another video. Yeah, it's not for this channel. No. <laughs> okay, let's go. Oh, the six and ride is very quiet. Yes. You don't hear the engine sound. Very quiet. Do you know where you're going? Are we going to Clio? We're going, Clio? Yeah, going to Clio. All right, that's the ocean down there. Because I was thinking about it, and you know how, like, when you enter the game? Yeah. You enter, and you're in, like, a random room? Yeah. That annoys me, because once you leave the room, you can never go back in. I think they're eventually going to change that. You're going to have your own apartment. That would be cool. Yeah. Because what's the point of having closets and things like that? Yeah. If you're just gonna. Question is how much money, real money, you're gonna pay to buy an to apartment. To have like an apartment. Yeah. <laughs> well, you might have to pay real money for for that to buy uh, some. I'm not so sure, but we'll see. Because CIG is not gonna miss this opportunity. Of course not. To make millions of dollars. Selling some apartments, prime real estate. It opens up a new world. Hey, real estate is a money maker, even if it's virtual. Oh yeah, it's always okay. So back to the testing over here. Okay. We have arrived. 
Oh, oh, I see some movement. Right? Let me pull away even more. Oh. Okay, you can see a little bit. But you oh. know, it looks like a humongous whale is going to come out of the ocean. Right? But I think it is right under the ship. It's right this one, yeah. It's right under the ship. Oh. Are you slow? going slow? Yeah, I'm going quite oh. slow. I don't want to die here. Oh, it's going to make a really good cinematics if this works well. Oh. Okay, I'm going to fly a little faster. Uh -huh. So you, you have to be close to the water. You see the wave following you. But I feel like it but needs... But where is the wake? It needs the after effect because it's only under the ship. I guess the faster you go... Oh, you can see the... See, if I go slow, you, you, you can only see a little bit of wave here, right? And if I go faster, oh, and you can see, ooh. Okay. It's like a fish is following you. That, that the white thing the pattern yeah. they put for the wave. They need to work on that. I'm sorry because it looks like text. Yeah, yeah. Like. <laughs> I keep wanting to read what it says, but it's not. It's just the pattern. Yeah. You need to break it up. Yeah, they still need to polish this. Yeah. But it's it's getting there. I, I feel like this is a pretty good feature. Oh, see? Yeah. Like how it indents? That's cool. Right. It's very realistic. Yeah. It's just the pat that pattern. If that needs to be refined. Ooh, if I go faster. You can see the the white as needs to yeah, get more white. polished. Yeah. Especially like that that clump right there. Yeah, the yeah. back. So like look like a little fish following you, a big fish following you. A giant fish. But... Who knows? Maybe that's the new character they're making. <laughs> no, I don't think so. Oh. Very enjoyable. Like this. If they can do this right. But I have a question. Yeah? What is the point of this? Oh. Do you... Do you drive over water a lot? Yeah. You can fly... Yeah. Star Citizen Are there is, ships? You can you can do a lot of... This is a sandbox game. You can... Ooh, you can see the little waves yeah, here. Yeah, those waves are cool. Right? Oh, this is nice. Well, you, you can just... Um, Sometimes just fly out, just enjoy yourself, have a lot of good time with your friends, or just, or simply just do what we're doing. We're testing right now, but sometimes we can just uh, fly the ship, fly out there, enjoying the ocean, enjoying the sunset on the uh, ocean, right? This water actually kind of freaks me out. It look, it's like a nightmare, like it's gonna shape shift into an alien and swallow me. It's a little too much the for the. Um, in the shape of a Masoni pattern. It's a little too much for the edges and stuff, right? What do you think? Yeah. Too sharp. Too sharp, yeah, yeah. And then the the paint, like the paint or the way they colored it is... Wow. The paint looks animated. Yeah. I don't know if that makes sense. But only when you see that when you get really close. When yeah. you go far, it's not like that. But if I put the ship down, if you put the ship down, Use it as a boat. Why? Because <laughs> <laughs> there is no boat in uh, Star Citizen yet. You see? As a boat. Oh, I guess not. No, you don't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't want to do this. It's just too risky. So what do you think about this feature? I think it's a cool feature. It needs to be refined. Um, so if they can work on the water patterns mm -hmm. in their graphic program it would look more realistic but i'm not a gamer so i don't really know the purpose of this um uh, <laughs> it just makes things more realistic more fun more details star citizen is all about okay details as, but as a much part of, i understand the details are great in star citizen but i feel like they could have used that resource to make other things better 
Because how many times are you going to be doing this? I think game? a lot of people will agree with you. I like this because I love my cinematics in this game. Yes, but how many people are going to bring right. their ship and use it as a sh bring their spaceship and use it as a water ship? Only you, honey. <laughs> 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 a, a few people will do, but I do agree with you. If they put some more other resources into the the thing that the bugs, the major bugs, the trams, the you know the train and stuff, the train, yeah, yeah, to yeah, to yeah. make it better, it will be a lot better. Yeah, because a lot of people is will be agreeing with you because uh, they put a lot of resources into things that will like in the on the surface make this game looks better. So people will buy their ships and stuff. However, when you really play the game, it's very encumbersome. It's very buggy, simply put. I mean, if they had a ship-ship hybrid, land, land space hybrid, like, no, space-sea hybrid ship, that would be cool. So you can fly it in space, uh -huh. and then you can use it as a boat ship on the ocean or whatever this is. Yes. On the sea, yeah. then I understand this water feature. But there's no real use for this water feature. Can I hunt golden fish and sell <laughs> it to Mr. Moneybags? No. Yeah. But also very weird is why there are two white lines you can see. Isn't it your... Thruster? Yeah. Yeah, my two thrusters. You're right. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, now you're under. Ah! Uh, but you're still in the ocean. No, but I, you were on a bed. What happened? I, I died. You can't get into the. See, they need a space space water hybrid ship. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure if you have the technology to make spaceships, the spaceship should be safe inside the water. Shouldn't be like explode like this, like get into the water and explode. I mean, in reality. But anyway. That's okay. A, that's another video of. Of things we <laughs> yeah yeah all right so this is it for this video guys thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next one bye bye